game on Falcon is so hard with Cloud, and it's just it's just not a good time. Right, but I don't I don't know if that would really help out with like Bowser either, especially with the well. The difference is is like Bowser's neutral is better versus Cloud than it is uh, than Falcon's is, and oh, also like okay. uh, for instance, Dreadfighter, who is a Massachusetts Cloud, right? He was like 9-0-1 shampoo the first time shampoo played Bowser, he two owed him. So like I know his Bowser is better against Cloud than his than his Falcon is. Okay. So we'll see how this works. Anyway, game one, Smashville. Uh, good stage for both uh, characters because Falcon gets some combo extensions and has a place to go to when he's off stage. Already losing his jump. Already taking 30. Oh, no, don't do no, it to yeah, him. I was going to okay. say, he has a jump, so he's making it back. But this is exactly what I'm talking about. Like, this matchup is so oppressive against Falcon. Because once he's in the air, there's nothing he can do. And once he's off stage, there's just so, much, so many options Cloud can do. But yeah, this stage is just like, it's good for Falcon because he's got combo extensions. It's good for Cloud. Wow, that's actually really rough DI. Trying to air wobble him with up airs. But like, Cloud can just go to the platform and charge limit for free. So it's definitely a good stage for Cloud, too. Actually, read the air dodge. Yeah, I read oh, the double air yeah, dodge that's for the cross stock. slash. Wait, no, it's I not. was going to say, he was mid stage. Yeah, no, he, yeah, he was. Now yeah. it's a little bit too Good far recovery away. there from uh, Shampoo Master. But bad DI on the dash tack, losing his stock. Yeah, no, this is going to start to get rough because, again, as you said before, it's just, Falcon's it's just not... Cloud is oppressive against Falcon. Yeah. Like, it's actually, like, one of the worst matchups that Falcon can have. And not the best neutral at all. Yeah, he's going for the air dodge read. And he actually misses the dash grab there. Yeah, this is a big lead here for Helper. Yeah, we're probably going to see the Bowser, like you Helper, said. Helper, I mean, Helper's game. playing really well right now. He knows to just get Falcon in the air and then get him off stage and just, <laughs> just trap him at ledge, and that's all he's been doing. Wow, okay. So I, I think right now Helper, he's just trying to finish this off. But like Shampoo, I think he's confused right now. He's he's really just trying to get whatever type of damage he can get. But again, I I, I think he's already thinking about next game and just pulling out maybe Bowser. Yeah, 100%. I know, I know Bowser's coming out. Yeah. But it's, it's just Helper's playing really well right now. He's covering pretty much all Falcon's options. And a good, yeah, I was going to say, great uh, Falcon dive there. That's a classic Massachusetts Tomahawk. <laughs> Antarvis used to spam that on everybody. Terrible DI on back here. Dies at 110 <laughs> with no rage. Okay. So, yeah, we're going to be seeing a JV2 from Helper taking game one. Yeah, that matchup is just not fun. Like, Fatality has beaten top clouds. Like, I know he's beaten Kamara Kiri before, but, like, even then, he loses to a lot of the top clouds. Yeah. yeah here it comes. Okay. Now, Bowser, Cloud, the thing is, it's also, like, if the if the Cloud plays safe and can space everything, it's actually really bad for, for, for Bowser. But the thing is, you're not always going to space everything, and you're going to miss space, and then you're going to get grabbed, and then you're going to get punished really, really hard, because Bowser's grab game on Cloud is very strong, so... That's why this matchup like used to be like, at least back in the day, people were like, "Oh, it's 50-50. And then as the, as Cloud's got a little better at spacing things right. consistently, it became more and more like uh, Cloud favor. But yeah, it's just Cloud in general. Just seeing, you know, first of all, you don't really see uh, too much of this matchup. Period. So it starts getting a little bit weird when you start talking about it. But also the fact that the Cloud is just such a damage-driven character, especially in neutral. Bowser being almost the same, it just becomes a it just becomes a Mexican standoff. It, yeah, where both characters can just punish each other really hard. Right. Yeah. And Shampoo's got him off stage. Got to be and an just, easy grab punish. Oh, what a mash by Helper! Oh, geez, that was like that's one of the best matches I've ever seen. <laughs> oh yeah. Oh, if that spiked, that would have been it. <laughs> but not missing the dare fair spike. Right. So actually, good DI from uh, from Shampoo. Border, yeah. I know a lot of clouds do not like this matchup though. Like even if it's like considered cloud favor, like a lot of them just uh, up throw up air should just take the stock if he gets three to the eye. Oh, there we he go. He does easy stock. Yeah, I know a lot of clouds do not like this matchup. Yeah, no, again, it's because they just get punished so hard. Like you get grabbed three times and you lose a stock. It's cloud, which is like pretty crazy because cloud is relatively heavy and with limit has a good recovery, but. Just up throw up air is so strong on him. Right. Wow, yeah, that was, a, that was a good air dodge read. Wow, that stage okay. bike him. That's nice. so unfortunate. The sour spot dare stage bike uh, shampoo, and now he's got full limit. So I'd actually say, even though shampoo has a 12% lead, this is actually helper favor right now. No, right. That's why it's a nice because helper right now, he's just really trying to pull this off, and uh, he was at he was at a clear disadvantage there. And right now, he shampoo. Stole, yeah, shampoo stole uh, helper's yeah. jump there. He just needed. He should have got under him more. Wow, that up air is actually unsafe. Oh Big punish God. here. Oh, so. Look at how much damage. But if Shampoo doesn't have a jump, it's going to be easy. Oh, my God. Oh is my God. up air? Oh, there we go. Oh, Shampoo, no. why? 
Why didn't he just up throw up air? Because like that, I don't know if that would have killed, but it was <laughs> it really good. It would have definitely been close. Helper yeah. right now is just trying to conserve this limit. He knows if he can get at least like 10 or maybe 15 more well, percent I think, off. I him. honestly think Nair Cross Slash Alleged will <laughs> probably take the stock off because he's got a little bit of rage. Yeah. Cross Slash is just silly strong. I think that's kind of why he's going for the falling up air to get falling up air uh, aerial finishing touch. It's starting to get scary. Oh, no. Helper is now like a little bit too wary to approach him right now, just trying to get any sort of like small damage. Well, he's playing the matchup properly now. Right, he's facing yeah. everything. Which is good. He downloaded him, essentially. Oh. Making a big mistake. The only thing, though, is he's out of... Oh, easy detail there. Yeah, that nice. was a really... In my opinion, that was a really bad cross slash. Because um, once he lost limit and took the damage, that was... He was out of Koopa percent. And he didn't have to worry about getting grabbed other than the kill throws. But that doesn't happen for another, like, 20 or 30 percent, so... But either way, Shampoo taking game two, uh, making the set, even in the set count, 1-1. One, one. Helper switching to Diddy because I know he has one. Classic New York player playing top tiers. Switching over to his other top tier from his original top tier. So Shampoo, like I said, he has beaten Entarps in this matchup. A very good Diddy Kong player, as you saw earlier. And uh, we'll see if he can keep it up. Because this matchup is actually, like, it's similar, where it's, like, Bowser, in theory, loses neutral a lot, but Bowser's punish game on Diddy is so strong. But we'll see if he can, uh, if he can win, win some interactions. Oh, yeah, already a 50% lead. Good up throw. Yeah, no, right now it's, it's just going to get to the point where... Oh, yeah, that actually, that barrel explosion was really bad because now he's in disadvantage on stage. Helper, oh, come on, where's oh. the, he missed input to the pivot grab and got dash attack. Yeah, no, helper right now, again, pulling out the, the Diddy is probably his best option. Oh, glad, I don't think he was really oh, feeling close to Oh, because almost of that took damage. the stock off yeah, of no, 90. That's, that's not going to go. Oh, the banana, this could <laughs> lead. Oh. No, no way, I was going to say, unless he had awful DI, it wasn't going to be Yeah. Anything. No way, it's gonna wow. take stock off. Yeah, Bowser, that's another thing in this matchup where like Diddy wins neutral a lot, but Bowser's so heavy that he actually has to work for his kills. That's such a good change. Because a detailed off smash, now that's a little stale, might not actually kill right now, unless he has more rage, but. Yeah, reading that banana pluck easy. Oh no. Yeah, that was, yeah, I got the cross up the eye, so. But he is it up the up air percent. Wow, good recovery. Okay. Yeah, no, I think Helper was playing a little bit too much off stage. That could have left. just going for the drop kick. Right. <laughs> oh, no. Oh, this could start to get a little bit bleak. If Helper can get at least maybe like 30 or 40 more percent, this could be it. Oh, oh Shampoo oh, barely missed space. Yeah, he missed space that up smash. Yeah, yeah. I know. I, he should have neutral got up there because I think he would add enough more ability to make a not hit. Yeah, I'm, I'm really just trying to hope for Shampoo right now. It's just that he just needs to take away this one stock. It's hard. And yeah. Because hitting oh. hitting Diddy in neutral is really hard with Bowser. But I will say, if he does take the stock off, he is at only at 66. So. Right. And that's that's kind of easy After, to bring back. Should take the stock off. It is. Shampoo only at 66. He can definitely bring this back. Helper's just got to play very patient like he's been doing. Oh. Get these get these landing traps. Get his bread and butter, just get Shampoo to like 140, and then he can start thinking about killing. Shampoo just kind of running away, keeping up the spacing, trying to get in as much damage as possible when he has a small window of advantage. Right. But Helper right now, just keeping the pressure going on Shampoo, that's and tough. that's gonna lose. No, actually, <laughs> Shampoo living at 130. Thing is, is he's ma almost at max rage of Bowser, but he's at, Diddy is at 0% right now, and that's the issue. Shampoo's out of a jump. I actually think Helper should have gone off stage and just spared him right there. Yeah, no, again, it's starting real well. What? what? No, he's just showing me something about melee. Yeah, yeah. Back throw? Yep, just getting him off stage. Wait, yeah, this, is, look, this is definitely this is definitely looking like Helper's got this. Pretty pretty in the bag. Detail fair. No, Helper missing his confirms. Oh, yeah, yeah banana up smash yeah. and Helper taking it 2-1 over Shampoo Master. Yeah, it's the fact that Shampoo can get, like, literally any damage off Helper there in that second stock. And, uh, you know, honest, I was honestly feeling kind of hopeful because, again, Shampoo 
with the Bowser. It could have taken like a lot of damage, at least at some points. Just couldn't find the right spacing, couldn't find the right opportunity. And just the aggressiveness coming out from Helper almost the entire set just kind of just kind of gave it to him, essentially.